Oh, hi. My name is John Rook. I am a black pope of the Church of Lushatology. Our religion is different than other religions because we don't require anything except for your liver. No money, nothing. We are a hedonistic group of people that enjoy fucking, smoking, and forest booze. The other religions will make you feel guilty for things that you want to do. We don't. We don't judge. Except if you wear a fanny pack. We don't like that. We also don't need uniforms. Oh, I'm sorry. But it's kind of fun to dress up. You know, especially when you're drunk. I'm going to take you on a little tour of Lushatologyville so you can get a sense of who we are and who our enemies are. Why don't you join us? There's another happy Lushatologist. He has no cares in the world. Recession? What recession? Join us. Be like him. Most religions want your money. We don't want your money. We just want your liver. Join us, won't you? I'm in front of the Kabbalah Center. Really? A religion that Madonna endorses? Don't be a fool. And $35 for a, a yarn bracelet? You can get a black bracelet for a Lushatologist for free. Let's go. You're probably wondering why Lushatology is free. It is free because we don't waste our money building monuments and churches. We don't need a church. Let me show you where our church is. Follow me. This is our church. As you can see, all the lights and all the color. Lushatologists are attracted to shiny things and blinky things. I don't know what it is, but we like them. But look at this, this is really great. Right next to a liquor store. How wonderful to have a bar next to a liquor store. This, my friends, is heaven. This is our church. No crosses, crucifixes, little red piece of yarn around your wrist. This is what it's all about. Booze. Delicious booze. Hi. I'm in front of what looks like a very unassuming building, am I right? Looks innocent enough, but behind those doors is where they have AA meetings, Alcoholics Anonymous, the church's chief rivals. We don't like quitters. We don't like them at all. Yes, maybe they get a cake for being a year sober, but if you're a Lushatologist, you can get drunk and eat cake all you want. We're so much better than them, don't you think? Lushatologists will take anyone, no matter what race, creed, or sexuality. We're that cool. Hey, if you're a Lushatologist and drunk like I am right now, that actually sounds good. I'm here in Mexico. Do you know that Mexicans have their own name for Lushatologists? They're called El Borochiacho. Isn't that cute? We're everywhere. Some religions say that they have more celebrities than anyone else does, which is a lie. Lushatologists actually have more celebrities than any religion ever known. Of course, most of them are dead, but it doesn't matter because during the time they were on this earth, they made amazing art, and usually when they were drunk. There are so many of these people that are Lushatologists or celebrities. Here's a few. Drunk, drunk, homosexual drunk, drunk, Lushatologist, 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 see? I'm not lying. We have more stars than the heavens. Heaven, isn't it? Look at all this delicious booze, vodka, wine, everything for your consumption. Get drunk. Fuck someone. Not even remember it. Call it a blackout. I don't give a shit. 
This is your trip to heaven. The reason why booze is on this earth is for us to drink it. Don't you agree? What are you waiting for? Come on. Get that stick out of your ass and get fucked up. Even if you have to resort to box wine. We'll still love you. Come on, let's get drunk. So that's about it. This is John Roker in Los Angeles asking you, no, telling you, join our church, Lush Etology. We're looking for you. We want you. Please join. Thank you for your time and your liver. Lush Etology. Our priests won't molest you, but our nuns certainly will.